Add in it the twin leaf lace stitch. English style. For this tutorial, you will need a pair of knitting needles and a ball of yarn. Special thanks to our sponsor, Knit Out of the Box, for providing today's yarn. Today, we are using their machine washable merino lamb's wool in the color plum. For this stitch, you'll need to know the following techniques knit, purl, knit three together, slip two, knit, pass slip stitch over, yarn over, yarn forward round needle, yarn over needle. To begin this stitch, you must cast on in multiples of 18 plus 7. Row 1. We're going to begin by knitting 4. Then we'll begin our repeat by knitting 4. Next we're going to knit 3 together. So we're going to insert our needle starting with the third stitch on our main needle and going through all three stitches at once and then we'll knit them as if they are one stitch. Then we're going to yarn over and knit one. Then we're going to yarn forward and go around the needle back around to the front and purl one. Then we're going to yarn over our needle. So we'll bring the yarn from the front over to the back so that we can knit one. And then finally we will yarn over, slip the next two stitches purlwise. Then we will knit one and pass these two slip stitches over the first stitch. Okay, then we are going to knit four. And we'll finish our repeat by purling one. So we'll repeat this sequence until the last three stitches in our row. Row two, we're going to begin by knitting three. Then we'll start our repeat by knitting one. Then we're going to purl eight. Okay, and we'll continue repeating the knit one and purl eight until we reach the last four stitches in our row. When we reach the last four stitches in our row, we are going to purl one and then knit three. Row three, we're going to begin by knitting four. Then we'll start our repeat by knitting two. Then we'll knit three together. Then we're going to knit one and yarn over. Knit one and yarn over. Knit one. Then purl one. Then we will knit one, yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit one. Then we are going to slip two stitches purlwise, knit one, and then pass the slipped stitches together over. And we will then knit two. and finish up by purling one. So we'll repeat this sequence until we reach the last three stitches in our row. 
And when we reach our last three stitches in our row, we're going to knit three. Row four, we're going to repeat row two, so we will knit three. Then we'll start our repeat by knitting one, and then we will purl eight. Okay, and then we are going to repeat this sequence all the way to the last four stitches in our row. And when we reach the last four stitches in our row, we will purl one and then knit three. Row five, we're gonna begin by knitting four. Then we're going to start our repeat by knitting three together. Then we will knit two, yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit two. Then we are going to purl one. We'll knit two again. Yarn over, knit one, yarn over, knit two. Then we will slip the next two stitches purlwise, knit the next stitch, and pass those two slip stitches over the other stitch. We'll finish up by purling one. So we'll repeat this sequence all the way to the last three stitches in our row. And when we reach the last three stitches in this row, we will knit three. Row six, we're going to repeat row two once more. So we'll begin by knitting three. Then we'll start our repeat by knitting one. And we'll continue our repeat by purling eight. So we'll repeat the knit one and purl eight until the last four stitches in our row. And when we reach the last four stitches in our row, we will purl one and then knit three. So repeat rows one through six until you've reached your desired length. And that's how you knit the twin leaf lace pattern. Want more New Stitch Today? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com.